Hello lovely. How are you? Good. I'm Nicola. It's lovely to meet you. I'll be assessing your hair and scalp today. Do you have any concerns at all? Okay. So, you're concerned about oily hair? Alright. Anywhere in particular? So, around the parting. Okay. Anything else? Okay. So, maybe slight scalp irritation or something. So how long have you been experiencing a greasy scalp for? Okay. So quite some months now. And what have you tried to do to help that? Okay. So you've tried to fair few amount of products. Change your shampoo and conditioner, okay. Mm -hmm. Do you dye your hair at all or is this natural? It's gorgeous. It's a lovely natural colour. I like it. How often do you get your hair cut? Do you go to the hairdressers for that? Okay, so when was the last time you had it done? Okay, so probably due around now then. And when do you normally go? Have you ever done you a hair and scalp check at all? Any particular reason? Okay. You know, all hairdressers are trained to assess the hair and scalp, but some, like us, are more advanced. So gliding my hands through your hair, it feels very smooth, very soft, very hydrated, doesn't not, it's not really anything coming out when I stroke, it's shiny, healthy. But sometimes shine can often get confused with grease. Now your middle ends and ends are definitely not greasy, okay? But I think we have a little bit around the parting. few split ends. Mm. 
and the brush just glides through. Flickers on it. That's wonderful. No breakage. more breakage down that bit. Yeah, and there. Okay. I can see by looking at the ends, a lot of split ends, broken ends, and that's why it's looking a little bit uneven. I can see here. I don't really know what's happened here, whether that's snapped off or if it hasn't really been cut properly. All right. Okay. So I just want to get a little bit of her. And... Wait, I thought I was seeing some lice then, some eggs. Has anyone in your family had had lice at all recently? Hmm. Let's double check here. I will have a look when I go through, but I don't know. Could just be a bit of dandruff. Hmm. Okay. Nothing to worry about. I'm sure it's nothing, but I will double check. Okay. Good. So, where is my light gone? No. Yeah, it does look like little eggs or something. Oh, you mean itching on your scalp match? I know you said you've had a bit of itching, but... Okay.
I'm just looking down your porting. Feel all right. Good. No, I can't see any lice or anything. You have got a little bit of dry skin. Here. Do you have an itch there? Hmm. So I've just done that and now you've got flakes in your hair so I'm guessing that's what the little bits were
His scalp, that's all. Yeah, it's definitely not head lice. I've got to worry. <laughs> I scared you a bit then, didn't I? Let's have a look with this to make sure. to check the oil. Oil scalp. Definitely some oil there. Last little one now. Just Yeah, you've definitely got an oily section here. And I think really that's down to the scabbing. I think, and this might sound silly, but I don't think you're rinsing the conditioner out properly here. I know, it sounds silly, don't it? But I think that's what's contributing to all this build up here. Because if I go like that, it literally peels off and it doesn't look like psoriasis. And that there, by your part, is really, really oily. And the more I scrape, the more oily it goes. Yeah. I think I know what's going on. Your hair needs a good cut. 
you need to take it up a little bit and get rid of all those split ends because you have got quite a few and we need to even it out all right i would recommend some split end treatment okay so it's just a special product that we can work on the mid lengths and ends just to help repair those all right now i want you to use a repair shampoo now your hair isn't damaged but the ends are a little bit so i think we're going to use a repair conditioner give it a nice condition put the moisture back in really help lock in to these ends now because of your hair where the oiliness is and the scabbing i want to use a product on you which is a scalp product okay so it works on really purifying the scalp okay so it's going to remove any flakes any build up it's going to help reduce any greasiness and oiliness around here okay and it's going to help clear up your scalp it's really going to detoxify it and really clean it now i want you to use that for two weeks with your repair conditioner okay then i think we'll should be okay with the grease and this bit as long as you are washing the products out properly okay so then if this is nice and clear we could use maybe a hydrating shampoo we could go for full in and do a repair with repair but i think that's going to be too much for you if you wanted a bit of volume we could use a volume shampoo or if you find that you are getting on better with a purifying one then we can use that the others may be a little bit too heavy for you so i recommend that we have some in salon treatments as well to work on your ends but i think once i've done a good cut if you want one bring it up a little bit you know sort out those split ends have that treatment on and use a special breaking well, it's like an anti-breakage spray when i have hairs wet that'll be good and if you are straightening or curling please make sure you are using a heat protective spray all right hair dry on about mid heat then make sure you go through afterwards with just a cold blast okay heat protector everywhere and comb through i would also like you to use a dark oil all right so shampoo then shampoo again so two shampoos so that's going to get, really give it a good clean the second shampoo is really going to get rid of everything okay then i want you to do a condition so condition it wash it all off correctly make sure it's all gone then i'm going to get you to scrunch your hair a little bit okay and then i'm going to get you to have this lipid spray okay it's gorgeous you're just going to spritz it all over lift sections up section that section comb it through you'll find it will just glide through it's really going to help repair your hair bonds okay then I would like you to pop on this perfecting ends a bit of serum mid lengths ends all the way down all the way down really make sure you've got enough on brush it then i want to give you some of this oil dark oil a little bit of pumps and make sure you're really going through your hair like so really bringing it through then brush then you can blow dry it as you would medium heat then cold blast brush it then if you want to straighten it straighten it but clip it up however you do it shake the heat protector spray it spritz it through spritz it through straighten and try not to keep it on too long all right then i would like you to pop a little bit of dark oil on again all right mainly around the ends and yes okay yes i forgot about that one so the the anti-breakage product that would need to be put on when your hair's wet so find the right time that suits you but you don't want to do this for too long because you're going to be adding too much to your hair and then that could make it greasy okay but yeah if you can do all that for two weeks okay so then we could 
swap over your shampoo if you want to to something else if not we can stick with that routine and then we'll just see how it goes for the rest of the month okay yeah okay any questions well if you'd like to book in with me i can give it a nice good cut sort it all out and obviously then i can you know monitor your hair and go through it with you step by step all right that's totally up to you but shelly is at reception if you'd like to go and book in all right my lovely you are very very welcome it would be nice to see you soon you take care now bye bye